I'm trying to build the world's most extreme backyard theme park. But with every theme park, there's got to be rides. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> so I did some research, made some phone calls, and I found a slide in Tennessee. Oh my. You're buying it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Before I made the purchase, I had to go and physically see the slide to see if it was in good condition for me to buy. Bro! I'm feeling it right now. It's really smooth. Oh my god, dude, you cooked some speed. So just the fact that I was able to ride down the slide as fast as I was able to and not put a hole through any of this shows how strong the slide is. After spending thousands of dollars and waiting months for the water slide, today is the day it finally gets delivered. I bought a water slide. A water slide. Today we are taking delivery of my water slide. In our last video, I went there and visited it, and here it is. I don't know how they fit it in these two trucks. This is insane. Wow, you have everything in it. And even the the whole the whole plat the whole No, I, I couldn't fit the, the tower, but that's gonna be on the next slope. So. Imagine like this. Yeah. <laughs> you haul. <laughs> I didn't wasn't expecting that. I was like, oh he's the same you haul? So what's weird is I actually have to look at the condition of the slide. You know, I get to see it now. Like look at this big crack in it. The whole water slide is damaged right here. Like a lot. As the slide was being delivered. I noticed there was a lot of stuff wrong with it. Hey, is this the most damaged piece? Can I see this one? Because it looks like there's damage on this one like everywhere. So this is what we couldn't see inside. Holy crap. I was trying to find out how many of these are damaged or not. So we know how much work we have to do. The entire slide was in perfect condition when I wrote it and looked at it in person. But now it's not even looking like the same slide I saw at all. It's a big moment for me to be spending this much money on a slide and then to be seeing this many broken pieces, you know. It just kind of breaks my heart a little bit like, oh, I paid so much for this. But um, there is a lot of work for this thing to be looking nice overall for this uh, this slide. I hope you can see this is a little bit stressful. Be buying and spending this much money on a on a dream and and and, and, and more than just a water slide. That that I'm hoping this works comes together. That I will continue being able to do this. I want to keep doing this, and I'm just. I hope it's gonna work, but I also I know it's gonna work. No one's done this. No one's doing this. You know, no one's reckless, crazy, and 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 doing it in this this crazy direction like this. You know, excited to build this thing. I'm excited for the rest of Rush Park, for the skate park, and for the rest of the builds that I'm gonna be creating here. It's just a lot to swallow when you're spending this much on one. Bro. I remember the last time I was in a U-Haul, I was in a pool. And now, I'm gonna enjoy it even more outside of it. In my backyard, in my own backyard. Now I just had to get the, the whole platform, which is the gnarliest part. I mean, it's just 28 feet. Of, how do you even get, get, you can't use a U-Haul, can you? To get it here? That's what he yeah. said, he said they could fit it in there. All the pipes too, that hold up the water slides? Confidence is through the roof with this guy, I swear to God. <laughs> Dude, everyone that drives by on this main highway is just gonna be like, what the hell are they doing now? That's a High five on my something Thank you guys so much. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you very much. Where y'all headed? Thank you. Back to Memphis. So about two weeks later, the seller told me that we need a forklift even though I paid $5,000 for shipping. Why wouldn't you tell us that in the first place? So I have my buddy Weston bring his tractor over here and unload the final pieces to our water slide. Thanks, Wes. You're such a sweetheart. I love you so much. Now that we've got everything delivered, I have to show my brother what we got ourselves into. So this is the main water slide thing that holds the water slide, right? Yeah. And it's supposed to be like, I don't know, 27 feet. Because they got a 26 foot truck, they cut the last two feet off because it didn't fit. Even though I paid for shipping, I paid $5,000 for shipping, they used a U-Haul truck. You can't use a U-Haul, can you? To get it here? That's what he yeah. said. He said they could fit it in there. All the pipes too that hold up the water slide? Yeah. So this is like the main piece they cut, right? That's the base of it too. That is so, that is ridiculous. The main piece that holds it all together has been cut, so they did that to get it here, but we can't use that piece to put it up. Yes, and all those pieces behind you too got cut too. Those are all the main support beams for the tower. Wait, they cut every piece? That doesn't make any sense. The, the entrance part is what matters. Like this is probably where the gate was at or something, you know? Yeah. But that's probably how it's supposed to be. But all these pieces, majority of every single piece is in good condition. Wait, what the hell? Except that right there. Wow, that is actually 
really, really, really f***ing bad. That's really bad. That looks not good at all. That's the worst part right there. That's the worst one. Hypothetically, someone could just go through that and fall off the water slide, because that's the bend too. Yeah, so with pretty much all of the water slide damage that we had, I had to reach out to the guy and see if he was gonna take care of it or help us with it at all. What about all the damaged parts? Do you do anything as far as helping us pay for replacing them? Or how does that usually work for you? No, no, we just repair it. Okay, so just patch it where it needs patching? I mean, is that part of your yeah, cost? I mean, because if you're planning on putting it up, I would think you'd figure that in, right? Well, the, the other thing is the slide has to be refurbished. We're just talking about the, the structural stuff, like the galvanized steel, like the three by three angle iron, stuff like that. Like there's not, there's not but a couple of straight pieces left out there. The slide doesn't need to be refurbished it, at all. It doesn't the slide, need to be The slide's fine. All it needs to do is be power washed and then maybe just like a, a nice new coat so, of gel. So, so this like guy's- a gel coat on top of it. Okay, so this guy's trying to milk us. Sends us something where he's like, all right, I'm gonna make all the money from when we put it together. So but I was like, no, we're not using you. So he got pissed off and now he's running because he got it. He's just taking this money and leaving with it. And he's not trying to help us at all. It's all for his gain. So it's not bad. for us. He's not trying to help us. He's not trying to be a good guy. He's not, he didn't get measurements to help us out. He literally just took the money and ran. A lot of it's broken or bent. Do you usually do anything as far as that? Replace the stuff if you don't rebuild it? Not, not in a case like this. You got that slide for basically free. Everybody is usually pretty excited. I'm a, I'm a little disappointed with how this whole thing's gone. You know, when everybody was complaining about us not having a forklift on your site to unload it which does never happen in any world you know i was a little disappointed so i mean we're fine just having you guys take it do whatever you want at this point you know and i don't think so, we're, we uh, want to run either direction right now i think if we could just get the print the prints and we'll explore that a little bit and even if we have to wait a while for y'all to do it yeah i, I need to feel a little more love. I'm, I'm a little pissed off, so you're telling me there's bent steel and you got a slide for free almost, and we're, people no, are we're, bitching at me. We're, we're not, we're not no, no. So, no one's yeah, bitching at you, we're just, we're we're just saying... At this point, I'm pretty happy to say you got your slide, everybody's all set. Nobody's saying that they're uh, disappointed. We're just asking if you were rebuilding something or if that was built into your cost, because it is, it's chopped up. That's all we were asking, so no one's disappointed. And. We certainly didn't get it for free. I understand you feel as though it's a good deal, but we did buy it. So we were just trying to figure it out. He's saying basically got it for free, but it's only 25K more in his head, but you still paid $15,000 more. And they sent it in a U-Haul. Yeah. I mean, and they awesome. chopped up everything. Like I bought a good slide and now there's like multiple slide pieces broken and the entire structure is cut up in so many different ways. And there's no plans to how to put it back together. Like when you buy a Lego set, there's like, there's direction one, here's direction two. There is zero directions. We have a bunch of pieces and we have to figure out how to put it back together. Sounds like we ended up running into some dirty people who had a cool connect to something we've always wanted. So let's just look at this from an optimistic point of view, okay? Yeah. We own a <laughs> water, water slide, slide yeah. okay? Yes. So that's awesome. What we should do is put the slide together on the ground, shape it together, clean it, yeah, and then we have the shape of it. And then all we have to do is transfer the posts and the the, the, the base and everything to the spots we where we want it at, which is over there by the tree, take down the zip line. So those are the next steps for us to have our water slide complete. Yeah. Because I'm trying to ride down that thing and jump into oh, the yeah. water. So, so when the so when the water slide's done, we're gonna take dolly carts, skateboards, scooters, BMX, yes. everything. And then after that's done, then we're gonna do a really nice finish on it, and then the water slide is gonna be complete. Yes, so. I love that. That is my dream right yeah. there, is that.